Introducing to you first in the blue corner, wearing shorts, bearing the Union flag and the Stars and Stripes, from Team Exile in Bradford, Brad Exile Conway! And his opponent across the cage in the red corner, wearing white shorts, trimmed with black, from AVT West Yorkshire, Dan Tempest! This is three three-minute rounds of boxing for the vacant CSFC 85 kilo boxing title sponsored by Yorkshire Caravans. The 17th fight of the night and we're back boxing. 85 kilogram title on the line. And it's Brad Conway from Team Exile against Dan Tempest from ABT. CSFC 13, just the action just keeps coming. We're on it guys, this is a title fight. 85 kg CSFC boxing title. Yeah, Dan Tempest is a, he's a nasty southpaw. He's, a, he's got some good power, but he's really awkward guy to try and fight. I know he came off uh, a loss. Well, his last fight was a loss in uh, the cage and even then where it was an early, an early fight he, he ended up getting caught but I think he's going to want to try and uh, demonstrate some of his striking ability in this yeah good stuff so three three minute rounds uh, both fighters uh, sounding each other out seeing what they've got let's see some action guys yeah Dan Tempest is always ready to bang and uh, Conway is always, always ready to throw down so uh, we should see some action. Fight tonight sponsored by Yorkshire Caravans. If you want a good caravan, get your send down to Yorkshire Caravans. <laughs> oh, massive <laughs> body shot. Wow. If that were body on the ground, you're pretty low. Wow, big body shot there from Tempest. They opened up things with like one giant tattoo. <laughs> oh, really oh, oh, with a knockdown on the bottom. My word, that was the one. That was the one. He, uh, he took his time. You saw him. He was quite confident. Kept his, uh, his distance, waiting for the right time, landed the left straight. Standing eight count there from Danny Walsh, keeping it safe here at CSFC. Inside the first round. See, Tempest needs to capitalise on this, but not rushing too much that he actually uh, lets his guard down and gets caught. Exactly. Both guys can ban. But easier said than done. Big respect to both guys for stepping into the cage for this boxing fight. What we got now? We've got some some posturing, some forwards and backwards stuff. Always interested to see a conventional stance against the southpaw stance. Boom! Body shot from Tempest. Good body shot. Mixing up left straights to body and head. Big body shot. So are we seeing a pattern emerging here? Is yeah. Tempest leading in off them uh, lead jabs set up and then pst, underneath? Tell you what, Conway doesn't seem phased by the body shots at all. No. He's just eating them up. Well, he's an experienced fighter, MMA, boxing, K1. That's it, end of the first round. Tempest got a knockdown there. Tempest just because of the, of the knockdown. Good movement by both fighters, showing experience and skill. I think uh, judges might score that 10 8. They were a knockdown, they were a massive body shot that nearly took uh, cut Brad Conway in half on that one. This is a title fight, so uh, yeah, both guys are going for the 85 kg CSFC cage boxing. Title. So that was the warm-up round, guys. That was your warm-up. Let's see what we've got in the next uh, next two rounds. If you were in Brad Conway's corner now, what would you say to, or how would you tell him to change his game to uh, to beat Tempest after you've just seen that first round? I'd say it's all about movement. I mean, 
Tempest didn't throw too many. Well, it was the first round. I think they're feeling each other out. The uh, the danger shots from uh, from Tempest were them big body shots, but he did get a nice straight punch on the button of uh, of Conway. It's all about movement. You don't want to be stood still in boxing toe to toe. There we go. Left up counter there on the button. Another standing eight count. Standing eight count on uh, Brad Conway. He's happy, he's smiling, he's ready to go again. Fantastic counter there by Tempest. Just saw his opportunity. Brad's right hand came down and he's got him on the button. Conway using his guard well there. You can see that he's been lulled in for a body shot and open he's uh, exposing his head so he's, uh, he's savvy to them. It's one of the things that obviously Tempest is going for the game where he's, uh, he's using his, his, his right jab to close the distance and then he's landing the haymaker to either the head or body. That's but it, he's even stalking. One, even when you time wrong, you're going to end up taking a big shot and that's a fantastic right cross there by Conway. Boom! Beautiful. Big up a cut by Conway. Conway, body shot from Tempest. Have the boff in it for this fight. If Brad had connected there, it'd have been good night, pops. Oh, definitely. Like I say, when, when you're this experienced and you're this size, this amount of power, it only takes one shot to be a game changer. That's it. Oh, big cross from uh, Brad Conway. Tempest looking to load up. Well, it looks like the nose has just popped of, uh, of Conway. Oh, Big I body think, shot. I think we're. Um, I don't think that we're uh, a body shot. I think he actually hit me in the ground. Oh, That's the third standing. Uh, Conway shaking his right hand out there. I, I don't know if he's injured himself or, or what. I think originally the the big body shot came off his off his glove and then hit him in the belly. Yeah, I don't. I think he's just shaking that out as a. Uh, Oh, a distraction and technique. That's a straight left. He's turned him. He dropped him, and that's the third knockdown for the round. It's all over. And I believe we have a new CSFC 85 kilogram boxing champion, and that man is Dan Tempest. One outstanding performance. He wanted to come here tonight after a loss, show his uh, boxing skills, and he's done that by the highly capable uh, Brad Conway.